Hello, hello, hello. Happy New Year to you. How's it going, people? Welcome to 2022, to the first vocal vitamin of 2022. What? It's 2022? Ah! Hard to believe, if you ask me. Um, my name is Bridget Boyle, and I am the founder of Unleash Your Voice. And Unleash Your Voice is an online singing course that um, is multifaceted and ever-developing. And uh, it helps people who are interested in singing develop their practice and gain confidence and enjoy what it is to sing. So welcome, um, Philia from Brussels. I'm so glad you're here. Thanks so much for tuning in. And uh, if everyone wants to follow Philia's lead and put where you're tuning in from into the chat, I really appreciate hearing from all of you. It also does help get my videos out there on YouTube. So the more you're commenting and liking and sharing and talking about this, the better it is for all of us um, because the larger the community can grow. So thank you so much for being here. I'm so... Um, you know, I feel pretty good today and I'm, I've am i had a lovely weekend and connected with some really nice friends of mine and um, just feel actually inspired by the new year. Sometimes a new year can feel a little overwhelming, but this year I feel really great. I'm excited for what's to come. Um, before I jump in with the warm up, I just want to say that this Thursday I'm starting a series with the East European Folklife Center. Um, it's The series is called Vocal Stylings of the Balkans. It'll be a uh, four workshop series on Thursday evenings at 5 p.m. Pacific time. Um, hello, Eve from England and Christy from Austin and Diane from San Luis Obispo. So glad you all are here. Thanks so much for joining. Um, so if you're interested in that workshop, you can look at the live chat um, on YouTube and you'll see the link to be able to join um, to register for that. I'll also throw it in. Um, actually, I'll just, well, you know, go to eefc.org. That's the place where you can register. So welcome Ghost on Twitch. Nice to see you. We've got Emily here. I'm so glad you're here. Um, uh, going back to Beograd on Friday and Paul here from New York. Wow. So nice to see you all. Thanks so much. So let's get started with a nice, big, low, deep breath. Take a breath in and exhale. Feel yourself in your body. Feel the power of your breath as you take another inhale and exhale. Start to lengthen the back of your neck a little bit just to kind of open up back there. Take another inhale in and exhale. Good. Now take that chin down toward your chest, even furthering the stretching of the back of the neck. And then start to tick tock your head side to side, really gentle, really listening to what your body's calling for. If it hurts or if it feels like too much, I don't recommend it, but if it feels good, go ahead and do it. Hey, Annie from Palo Alto, so glad you're here. Oh, good. And then roll your shoulders back. As you roll your shoulders back, really feel the opening in the front of your chest. The more room we can create and the more relaxed we can get, the better our singing practice is gonna be. And then roll your shoulders forward, opening up the upper back, really feeling that opening. And then you can put your hands on your shoulders if you'd like and do some elbow rolls. Awesome. Um, let's give ourselves a little face massage. This is my favorite part of the warm up. So, um, as you're doing this, you can start to make some noise and like hum to feel the resonance of your voice inside of your head. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. And then take the take your fingers down the side of your cheeks and give yourself a little jaw massage, loosening up there. Hey, Nancy from Berkeley, nice to see you. I had a lovely walk this morning in Berkeley and it was just so beautiful out. It's kind of cloudy, but the crisp air is still there. It's so lo lovely. 
Ah, oh, hey, Sarah from Inverness. I'm so, so glad you're here. Thanks for joining. And then take your hands to the back of your neck and just give yourself a little neck massage. This is the how to start the new year with a little self-love. Oh, yeah, that feels real good. Awesome. Shake your hands out. Brian from Panol, so glad you're here. Wow, man, I got a, I got a lot of folks here today. I'm so glad. Thanks so much for joining. Give yourself a little chest pounding and start to make some sounds. Oh, loosen up. Oh. Sing as if nobody's listening. We're just making some noise. Oh. Hey, Therese, I'm so glad you're here, right? It feels so good today. It's like extra special good. That's my experience at least. Awesome. So now we're going to do... Um, a horse lips with a glissando. And if you have trouble doing horse lips, um, you can just do an ah, a nice y, a vertical ah, or you can do um, a tongue roll, like that kind of thing. Or if you want to put your fingers in your cheeks to help initiate the horse lips, that also works. And horse lips, actually, sorry, before I get into the horse lips, just let's tune in with the breath a little bit. So go ahead and force all of your air out of your body. Yeah, Philia, the workshop is virtual. And then relax your air in. Blow your air out. Relax your air in. Great. The next one, let's go on a glisson on a glissando with a horse lips. Good. Take another breath in. Relax that air low into the belly. Kind of feel your pelvic bowl filling up. It's a nice way to think about it. And then do another glissando. Awesome. We're going to take another breath in. And then we'll open up the mouth and do an ah. Great. Now let's go A. As you start these, try to be really gentle on that starting. We're not bringing the cords together like that. We're just starting real gentle. So nice and relaxed. Now A. A. E. E. O. O. Now hum and chew. Um, Feely, I want to answer that question about will the workshop be recorded? I'm going to check in with EEFC about that. I know that they do record the workshops. Whether or not they're available afterwards is a big question. So I'll find out. And Nancy, I'm so glad you got to hear some live music. That's great. Live klezmer music. Um, beautiful. So now let's just, um, we're going to do... We're just going to go on an ah. Uh, we're going to go one, four, five, four, one. Ah. Uh, uh, you know what? I'm going to change this. We're going to go ah. Uh, 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 so one, three, four, three, one. It's a nice, gentle way to start warming up. Ah. Uh,
nice to sound oh. I am going to go run over to the dining room table and grab my water. Please excuse me. Cool. Um, yeah. How's everybody doing out there? Doing good? I'm really feeling, feeling the vocal warm up today. It's so nice. Um, great. So let's do, um, oh, I know what I want to do. So we can do this one on either uh, any vowel that you want to do it on, um, or horse lips, I'm going to do it on horse lips. Um, or there's so many options here. So I kind of like want you to do what feels right for you. So you could do coo, 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 or gee, 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 or Let's do those three options. And, you know, I give you options because um, what works for you, you know, might be different than what works for me. And that's one of the beautiful things about an ongoing singing practice is we learn what works for ourselves. Awesome. Here we go. Beautiful. Now take a nice glissando. Oh. Awesome. Hmm. Cool. So Eve is saying she's going to sail the apple trees with some of the singers from my local club this week. That's so great. From the local folk club. That's awesome. This is inspiring me to um, have like a weekly uh, singing commitment moment. Where as we're going through this warm up, and maybe by the end of the warm up, you can think about one thing you're going to commit to this week. It could be singing along with your favorite song. It could be, you know, doing vocal exercises every day this week. It could be um, acknowledging yourself as a singer every day, you know, just saying, I am a singer. I am a singer. Um, signing up for a workshop. Um, anything. So if you have something that um, will engage you with singing this week, um, I would love for you to, um, you can internally commit to it, or you can put it in the chat, um, whatever feels nourishing to you. But um, for me, I'm actually going to be taking a an Irish folk singing lesson tomorrow morning. I'm very excited. I'm going to be studying with a woman named Mary McLaughlin, who's in Ireland. And um there's a lot happening with my sort of Irish heritage uh, stuff right now. I'm really excited to be building that. So um, anyways, that's my commitment this week. Um, yeah, so let's do, let's go to this one here. This is an agility practice, which I feel like is quite nice after what we just did. So this will be uh, my voice is strange right now, but that's okay. We keep going, keep on going. <clears throat> awesome. Sweet. Mary's wonderful. I'll try to sign up for the SBCC online course after this practice. And that's exciting. I'm excited. So here we go. Yeah.
Take a nice passando. And then hum and chew. Hmm, check in a little bit. Oh my gosh, you've got so much exciting stuff happening over here. Um, singing solo in church on Sunday. Um, a lullaby from Hebrides, originally in Gaelic. Very cool. Sarah's gonna sign up for the course with me. That's great. Um, there's the there's the my course, the Unleash Your Voice course, and then there's the East European Folk Life Center workshop series. Both are gonna be rad. Um, Emily's committing to taking care of her voice every day and learning the words to your new solo. Good for you. That's awesome, and um, fantastic. Yeah. I'm also committing to drinking this much water every day. <laughs> um, yay. Hey, Jaseya, I'm so glad you're here. Thanks so much for joining. Um, cool. Let's go ahead and move toward um, the Bulgarian warmups. Um, mm, actually, nope, we haven't done this one in a while. Let's do a little breath, a little breath challenge. So um, this one, we're just going to do, um, it'll be a major second and then a minor third, and then a major third on all these words here. So I will show you how it goes. <clears throat> ah, great, Philia, gonna practice vocal ornaments every day. That is so beautiful. The thing that's so great about that is you can practice it at any time. You can practice it in the shower, you can practice it while you're driving, you can practice it when you're laying in bed trying to go to bed, you know, like any time you can just go, Ah, as a start, and then you can also, you know, practice more complicated ornaments. So that's fun. Okay, so here we're gonna do mi a mi e mi o mi u mi a mi e mi o mi u mi a mi e mi o mi u. So the idea is to be able to get through all of it on one breath. It's kind of a long thing to do on one breath. So if you have trouble with it, fear not, you will improve with practice. Let's go here. Fantastic. Now take a nice glissando. Oh. Yeah, Philly is saying she never thought of exercising her voice in bed, which, you know, that makes sense. Um, sometimes I'll wake up in the morning and the first thing I'll do is like, hmm, just a nice little gentle hum as, as I'm coming to the day. So um, that's a nice way to, to warm up in the morning. <laughs> okay, great. So let's go ahead and check in with Dana. Um, um, so, you know what? No, I don't, I'm sorry. I want to go to this other one. I thought I was, I want to, I want to hang out with Kalina today. <laughs> um, so yeah, this is a warm up I, uh, learned from Svetanka Vadimezova, who's an incredible, uh, Bulgarian vocalist and a long time teaching, uh, vocal teacher and mentor of mine and Kitka's and True Life Trio and all sorts of people have learned from her and she's amazing. Um, so uh, this one's in 11, 
one two one two one two three one two one two one two one two one two three one two one two one two one two one two three one two one two so i'm going to put that rhythm up underneath the words and so the melody starts on this fourth and then the harmony starts on a second if you already know it go for it and just start singing whatever part you know if this is new to you just you know uh, we'll, I'll, I'll be singing it many, many times in a row, so I'm sure you'll get it. And I'm going to do the melody and the and the drone part one right after the other, so you can learn both parts. <laughs> Kadina drei pereshe momakali no kalino. Kadina drei pereshe momakali no kalino. Kalina drei pereshe momakali no kalino. Kalina drei pereshe momakali no kalino. Kalina drei pereshe momakali no kalino. I want to just stop here for a second and talk about droning and uh, how incredibly um, important the drone is uh, throughout music uh, all over Eastern Europe and other parts of the world. And one of the things I love to think about with droning is having a nice solid, it's like you're creating this column of sound. And this is something I, um, this is an image that Michelle Simon who's a dear friend of mine and an, another um, co-teacher and just wonderful singing partner. Um, she talks about this column of sound idea and um, Hey, Kathleen from Oregon. And Eve is talking about how singing low can be, feel really relaxed. That's awesome. I'm so glad you feel relaxed in it. Um, yeah, and that drone, um, you're creating a horizon for the harmony to sit on. So really trying to think of like, how do you say the words in a way that has this very smooth um, action to it? Here we go. Kalina drei pereshe momakali no kalino. Also, that column of sound idea can come through with the melody. Kalina drei pereshe momakali no kalino. 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 Awesome. Take a nice glissando. Oh. And now we're going to say hi to Dragana. 
and we're gonna do dragano draganchitze to go lower in our range and then we'll close it out for the day so here we go here you can sing either a top a high drone dragano draganchitze dragano draganchitze is option two or dragano draganchitze Keep the focus in your sound. Now just take a nice glissando ah, and take a breath in and exhale. You've done it. Happy New Year to you. Happy Monday. Thanks so much for being here. <clears throat> it really means a lot to me that you all continue to show up. Um, if you would like to uh, support the work that I'm doing, I do accept tips on my PayPal, paypal.me slash Bridget Boyle or my Venmo, Bridget.Boyle. Um, and I really, really appreciate any support you're able to offer me. Um, again, I'm starting to teach a workshop this Thursday through the East European Folklife Center. It's called Vocal Stylings of the Balkans. We'll be learning probably, I think I'm going to do two songs from Bulgaria, a song from Serbia, and a song from North Macedonia. So i um, very excited to, uh, to work with you all and to see you all. And again, I'm so grateful you're here. Um, thank you for ongoing support. Um, if you want to check out the Unleash Your Voice course, it's right there, unleashyourvoice.me. I'm going through some major revamping of it, and um, we'll be doing a big launch, uh, hopefully about February, uh, maybe mid-February. So um, I'm really stoked about some of the things I'm going to be doing. And um, if you have any feedback for me on anything, I did a survey at the end of the year. Um, but if you have any thoughts about things or things that you would love to know from me or, you know, learn about, or if you want to take private lessons or anything, please reach out to me, Bridget at BridgetBoyle.com. Um, I really appreciate all of you. And I look forward to seeing you one week from today, 930 AM. If you know anybody who would benefit from this practice, please do let them know that I do this. Um, it is um, a real joy for my life. So I, I love to grow it. Thanks so much. Take care.